woman here. You were born on the 26th of November 1974. You are a mother of three children. Right now, you are in the basement in the overflow. The Lord says, today is your day of cleansing. But the reason why God said I should pull you up, because you are wearing beads. I'm seeing you are wearing beads. Under your clothes, there are beads. Ramama, blue and white beads all around. You have no teeth. You were playing netball in 2015. You fell and lost your teeth. You have one standing here, one on the other side, nothing in front, nothing at the back ex except one I am seeing inside. Jesus. Right now you're looking with one teeth here. In fact, down here, I'm seeing that you have three teeth. They are whiter than the rest. It's because they are fake. I'm giving you these, these details to tell you that God has located you. He wants you specifically. Thank you, Jesus. Because your day of deliverance is today. Receive it. You are hallelujah. That is the basement. Jesus is Lord. I am I, I cannot hear you. I cannot hear you. The prophet has spoken. Oh God. Mm. May the Spirit of the Lord locate you too today. Mm. Tense church and reach out to God. I am seeing promotion coming down like rain. I receive it. Your life will never be the same again. I am seeing promotion. I receive God is promoting his sons and daughters. I receive it quickly. Receive it. Your time has come. You will never be the same again. You will never be where you used to be. I receive God, He's changing you. He's changing your time. He's changing your story. In the name of Jesus. Oh God. Faithful Savior, Spirit of Revelation, work in your servant, Jesus. Oh my God. Do something new in my life. Something new in my life. Something new. Look at this. Do it, Look Lord. At this. Yes. Take it out. Take Glory it out. To, there's the blue and hey. white beads. Oh. Jesus. She's destroying it's them. Over for you, devil. Oh, God. I what a deliverance. See the power of God all over. I cannot do mm. without you. It's a day of cleansing. I cannot. Mm. Without you, oh, Lord. do something new in my life. Something new in my life. Something new in my life. Oh, Lord. Cleansing is taking place right now. Thank 
de ti. Deliver her, Lord. Thank you for blessing us. Never the same. Bring her, bring her, bring her, bring her. Okay, look at me, look at me. Look at me. Look at me, control yourself. Look at me. My God. You see this? Jesus. This is the reason why Jehovah say, I should call her. Because you can't do cleansing while you have this. You see, with a jacket closed, you can't see That's right. this. It can only be the eyes of the Lord. Yes. Mm -hmm. Very true. Only the eyes of the Lord. Are you hearing me? Amen. I don't want to ask you to show your teeth. Can you show? Can, can, can you show? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Mm. Sorry for doing that. Sorry. Mm. The reason why I did this is not to be disrespectful. It's just to show somebody that it's not a, you know, a planned or I've been checking you. Are you hearing me? Yes. Now, woman, I want everyone to know if you are here today, you are sorted. I receive it. I am sorted. Thank you, Jesus. There are times where God remembers men. And when he remembers men, he anoints one from among them. Yes. My name is Aflo Kao. I stand as a servant of God. I stand as an instrument. I'm nothing by myself. But he called me, anointed me for difficult matters to hold your hand. Let me tell you, together, we we'll kick that devil out of your life. Now, look at this. She is here. She is right there in the basement. There are thousands of people outside in the basement. Thousands of people. The Lord says to me while here, there is one. Who is repeating and declaring what you are saying, but is still carrying an obstacle, and that this will undermine everything that I'm doing, the Lord said, and say you should call him. And the Lord showed me this woman, just as I say, if you check her, even now it's very difficult to check, but if you check her, you will know that I see. Right. I have a preview of details that a human naturally cannot have. That's true. I can tell a dentist what to do to help her. For you to verify what I say, she has to open her mouth for you to check that. Okay, there is a teeth here. Here, there is nothing. There is one here, one here. There is nothing here, and that down here, there is here three, one, two, three. You, you gotta be. Mm -hmm. And family, I'm not saying this to sell to you that I'm some, something, but I'm selling this to sell to you that my God is the greatest Amen. ever. Amen. Because if God will show details like this, I saw the beads. The problem is bigger. Look at me. What's your name? Sarah. Sarah. Yes. Now, Sarah here, I see Sarah 2015, 2017. You are a teacher in grade R in a school called Rainbow private school, Rainbow Primary School. Sarah, is that true? Go, Pastor! Go, Pastor! <laughs> there is something that is happening in your life. 
everyone rejects you. It's like you carry a spirit of rejection. People just throw you away. After two years of working and pouring yourself in the school, this is what you feel in your heart. You feel that they have thrown you away unfairly. That's what you feel. Be because even when you fell and lost your teeth, it was on behalf of the school. You were teaching little children how to play netball. Is that true? Yes, Pastor. Now, you, you have been seeing your life degrading. It's like the devil stepped in. You studied. You are a teacher of a school. But right now, there is nothing happening. Since you lost the job, your life went from misery to misery. Is that correct? God, you know you help me. May the eyes of the Lord I serve be on you today. In the name of Jesus. But you see, the reason why now you are falling for the trick of the enemy is because you're looking at your situation, you're saying that uh, maybe this is an option. When you are growing up, your grandmother used to tell you that there is a spiritual call for you to be a ritualist. You refuse that all your life, but now you feel you are in the corner. Don't cry like that, you make me cry. Jesus. Oh God. Mister, can you help me? No one helps me. Even my family is rejecting me. loves you and is helping you today look at me is that correct what I say yes pastor you feel rejected <laughs> no one even my children they don't like me <laughs> no one no one I'm alone I'm alone. Mm. 
Look at this. If you can see what I'm seeing, you'll understand what is happening right here. Mm. There is deeper than what I see. That's right. You know, I say to God that I always say a maximum of 25% of everything that He says or He shows me. I have never prophesied more than 25% of what I see. And the reason why I do that is because whatever we do here is not a show. Mm. And oftentimes the word of knowledge is just a, a sign. A sign to let you know that the eyes of God are on you. Amen. And that God knows you, the details of your life. Mm. And it's, it's meant to create awareness of God around you. And to increase your faith in what God is about to do. Amen. If you will see... 15% of what is happening here, you will understand how sad this story is. Sometimes we are too quick to judge people because you have seen the beads. Yeah. But if only you understood what led to the bead, maybe you'll begin to have compassion. Yes. You'll begin to understand that God should do something. A God who cannot intervene in the affairs of man. A God who cannot heal. A God whose hand cannot manifest is not needed in our time. We need a God who is able to show mercy. Yes. And that is our God. He's the only one seated upon the throne with all power in his hand. He's the healer. He's the deliverer. Amen. He's the one who makes a way where there seems to be no way? Amen. I am praying for somebody. A miracle will happen to you. I receive it. The devil like it or not. I receive. Now look at this. This is out of desperation. You saw that there is nobody standing for you. Everybody's rejecting you. Two months after leaving your job. I am seeing you on the street, Marble Street. And on that street, you met a man called Marshall. I am in 2017. Marshall, tall, dark, with braids. He told you what your grandmother used to tell you. He said you are called to be a ritualist, a witch doctor, a sangoma. Yes, is Pastor, that true? Yes. And he gave you a sniff. Yes. And he say, use this, sniff this. The ancestors will speak to you. Yes, Pastor. Is that true? Yes. Did it happen as I, I am saying it? Did it happen like that? That he gave it to you? Yes, Pastor. Okay, listen to me. Look at me. Did it happen like that? Yes, Pastor. And now. Tell me, what did you do? What happened thereafter? I just did what he said. And, and he said that my, my, my granny, he said he wants a blue beat. That's why all of the people, they are rejecting me. <laughs> but nothing changed. <laughs> nothing changed. <laughs> Can you imagine you walking in the street, you meet somebody who does not know you and give you a demonic word of knowledge? Mm. Look at this. If the church cannot do better, the enemy will seem like winning. That's right. But no more. I'm here. No more. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. If your God is dead, come try mine. You see, the reason why I speak like this, I, I'm bold in God. I believe the word. I believe what is said. The word of God is what is happening here. 
The word of God is not some talk. The word must become flesh. This is the ministry of the word. The ministry of the word is the evidence that the word brings. He say, I will bless you and you are blessed. That's Amen. the ministry of the word. He said, I will heal you and you are healed. Amen. That's the ministry of the word. The ministry of the word is not how to spell healing. Today, a package is coming from heaven to you. I receive it. Zoto Roboshia. Look at this guy. Break it. Break it. Break it. Stretch your hands toward her. And pray, break it. Break it. A song of my spirit is living on. Live! In Jesus' name. Thanks, oh God. Total deliverance in the name of Jesus. Never the same again. Oh, Jesus. Set up real God. Go your way, and the Lord has served. Bless you. It is well. In Jesus' name, celebrate Jesus. your mother no, who's this auntie. one sorry my auntie and who's this my stepbrother come here my god jesus mm. healing is coming healing mm. is coming thank you jesus there's quite a lot happening right now oh jesus Stretch your hands toward her. Let me tell you, you have come to see God here. Yes. You've been connected before. Oh, yes. You're absorbing. Mm. Give this. Are you going back on Wednesday or so? Oh, yes. You're going back on Wednesday? Yes. All right. Somebody will help you. Yeah. Off microphone. Okay. Somebody will help you. Does your mom pray? Yes. She's a woman of God? Yes, yeah, she is. Here and there? Yeah, but she, she's, she is. She is. She Thank prays. Jesus. Okay. She's trusting God for something yeah. linked to a visa. Yes, her passport. And she's watching me right now. She's, she's watching you. <laughs> she's watching Glory to Jesus. Speak to her. Tell her that the time has come. Speak to her. <laughs> Mommy, your time has come. <laughs> Oh, Jesus, God man. has located you, yes. He does this. You know, you, you are dear to your mom. You are dear to your mom. The reason why I say that, that, that she serves God, that, that she loves God, is because God has located her. Okay. She's you, trusting Jesus. God. Is she in Europe? Yeah, she's in Spain. She's in Spain? Yes. Okay, speak to her in Spain. Mommy. <laughs> Mommy, you said it. We are here. God has located you. He has seen you. <laughs> Glory to Jesus. Woo! Yeah. We we'll speak to your pastor, okay? And we'll take it from there. Stretch your hands. You see, your daughter is here. For you to know that. that, that 
Brasil. I see you have a problem. And you're trusting God for visa or passport. And the Lord spoke to me that is solving it now. 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 Receive yeah. it. God said that the grace that he had released upon you is what brought you this far. You had many battles, but he kept you with a strong hand. He protected you. He said, I should tell you, wipe away your tears. Thank For you, greater Jesus. than you have seen is yet to manifest. Thank you, Jesus. And I hear me. I'm hearing reward, reward, reward. Those who betrayed you yesterday, those who mocked you will admire you in this town. In the name of Jesus. You, 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 you have entered into your season. You, you will come, 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 come. Your, your situation is sorted. Thank you, Jesus. It's a good time. Mm. We're praying for you. You said it yesterday. You said that yesterday. We talked about this yesterday, that we will all come together to testify because I know that today it is settled. I know. I don't know, but I believe so. You I see, don't know why. The, the, there is something. You, 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 you are connected to the altar. That's why you have been addicted in seeing us to, to draw from us. But hear this. I am speaking acceleration. Amen. Receive it. <laughs> and somebody got to help you because there are people that we need to root out. I just don't want it to become a media story. Do you understand? Yes. I just don't want media story. Ooh. But there are people that we need to kick out. Yes. Jesus name. And they will know that you came to see our flu cow. Name of Jesus. Reba Satan. Jesus. Is this your child? Yes, my daughter. She's special. I know so. You know so. I know. She's your daughter. Yes. I know. How many are there? Just two, a boy and a girl. A boy and a girl. Yes. Chidiki. Chidiki and Crystal. Chidiki, yes. And yes. Crystal. Glory to Jesus. Mm. Your children are, are your treasure. Yes, I love them. You know so Stanley. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay. Okay. Oh, yes. All right. We stop it. It is well, my precious daughter, you, it is Jesus. well. It is well, it is well. It is well in the name of Jesus. It is well with my soul today. It is well, it is well, it is well. It is well in the name of Jesus. It is well. Lift your hands, stand up as we thank God together for what he has done. If you believe God has done it now, you are here. You have still your papers. You're supposed by now to have your phone and call them and say, anything happened? <laughs> Whatever you pray for. I am seeing ministries being cleansed, Amen. finances being cleansed, Amen. families being cleansed, people's health being cleansed. I receive. Your life will never, ever, ever be the same again. Lift your hand and thank God. Thank Him. Thank Him. Thank Him for all that He has done. My Lord is well. It is well. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We are.